All right, so we have four first round picks this year. Very nice. Oh no, sorry, three. All right, we don't have a second. That that one's from the next year. All right. So now we have Shattenkirk to trade away. All right. There we go. Um. So we're not going to be able to get any of those defensemen that I was talking about. Is there any other young rookies that we can get? Um. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna search too long here. Just a quick one. If there's any young guns. No, I want like someone who's really good, really young, really good. So a salary is not coming up anytime soon, but uh, I can tr I can sign them long term in the next like two or three years if I get the chance. Uh, 24. Hang on. Nope. Man, I don't want to go through every team here. I'm almost done. I'm almost done. Uh, nope. The trade value will be high enough. I will be able to tell. Nope. Nope, I don't want any 24-year-olds. They're just going to be traded away right away. Uh, it's not, nah, it's not, it's not high enough there. It was good for a 19-year-old, but I'm looking for like a, another Crosby or something like that. Uh, nope. Uh, nope. We're almost done. Nope. <laughs> Columbus. No, we've already like taken all the good prospects from every team. Nope, Colorado. Nope, Carolina. Nope. Calgary. Nope. Buffalo. No. Uh, nah, he was 23. Don't need another defenseman like that. Bowie. No. All right. So, this is what we're going to do. Shattenkirk, we are going to give to a Western Conference team for a bunch of first round picks, all right? Uh, so, there you go. I'll take two of those. But you know what? I'll take one from this year. I already have three this year kind of thing. Um, yeah, I already have three this year. I'll set them up for the years after this year. We have first for this next year. We have 21st for the year after that. Uh, I don't think I'll get more than two for Shattenkirk. And do you have any young guns who I could just take? It's compensation, not really. Um, Alright, just give me somebody with a one one year left kind of thing with no trade value. This Hinka guy, there you go. Well, why don't they accept that now? Come on. McQuaid, all right, they won't accept that. Hang on a sec, let me find another team. Calgary, if I put Swanson in there, yeah, okay, they'll accept that. Very good. In the same draft positions as before. Uh, there you go. The 20 and the 22, that's fine by me. Um, two first round picks, uh, I could probably add another second or something like that in there, and a second, two first and a second for Shattenkirk basically, we're freeing up that cap space, thank you Shattenkirk, alright hopefully this goes through, thank you for your uh, time here in Tampa Bay, but it's time to move on, we'll go through, uh, let's be honest here, okay they won't accept that, come on man, it's freaking Shattenkirk, you're getting like a, a stud of a defenseman who's proven in the playoffs Calgary, let's go. Um, all right, give me the first. For, nah, no, nah, no, nah, I don't need the first for this year. The first for next year. And the first for the year after that. There you go. Uh, for Shattenkirk. And I'll give him that Farfard guy as well. Farfard. I don't need this guy. He's 25 years old. There you go. Uh, they're going to have to give somebody back. Um, one more. Yeah, there you go. Perfect. All right. So Shattenkirk and Farfard for two first picks. All right, I'm pretty sure that'll go through the way it is. I won't ask for a second or a third. I'm just picking up picks for the next few years, all right, so we can continue to grow. All right, thank you, Shannon Kirk, once again, but it's time to it's time to move on. I need Ekman Larson, and when I get Ekman Larson, then I can make a trade for another stud of a defenseman, and we'll have six. And we'll have all these first-round picks that we got from uh, Bolu and Shannon Kirk. Will it go through? There it is. Calgary Flame fans are going to be cheering in the streets. All right, so there's another one of our key defensemen. From the past, Gonzo Alonzo. That's all right, boys. We had to do it. All right, we had to do it. We're holding on to Bernie Mac. And, oh, actually, Bernie Mac is the full trade value as well. But he'll have a full trade value for another three years. So that's okay still. All right. Um, defenseman, we're going to try and re-sign Ekman Larson to trade him away. All right. Unless we can get him for like seven or eight. I doubt it. Um, but we have plenty of young guys who are ready to come up to replace Bolu and Shattenkirk. They're both off more offensively gifted. We're going after a defensively orientated defense now. All the way. All right, right wingers now. Dustin Brown, he's got to go. Left wingers, uh, everyone there stays. And centers, everyone there stays. So it's just Dustin Brown, he's got to go now. 
All right. So same thing. I'm just going to go after two first-round picks. I'll go after Anaheim's two first-round picks. Can I get them both? Uh, nope. Let me just find a team that can accept it without even a, ex another player going back. There, Carolina. Actually, I don't want to send them to the East. Chicago, no. Colorado, no. Columbus, no. Dallas, no. Detroit. All right, we can send them to Detroit. There we go. Uh, give me your first for next year and the first for the year after that. All right. Um, and you can take a seventh and a sixth and a fifth just so I don't piss them off. All right, so Dustin Brown for two firsts from Detroit in uh, 2020 and 2021. We'll go through. Um, uh, you're not interested in absorbing any more one-way contracts. Give me a break. All right, hang on. Hang on a sec. All right, so we can uh, draft this Howard Heatley guy. There you go. Get on our team. We'll scout him upcoming. Uh, the next draft pick, uh, Victor Kulikov, center sniper. We don't need another Sontag, offensive defenseman. Stumple, left-wing sniper. Let's go after these uh, two defensemen. Sontag, there you go. And another defenseman. Yeah, Ralston. There you go. Get defenseman. All right. Now, hang on. I'm not done yet. Still have to trade away Dustin Brown. I told you guys it's going to take a while. Even after my pre-scouting, still taking a while. But I'm going to get this all out for you. Um, what team was it? Detroit that wanted them, right? But they didn't want to accept another one-way contract. Give me a break. Uh, one-way contract with one year. One-way contract, one year. There you go. Trop for Dustin Brown. Give me your two first-round picks from next year and the year after that. And there you go. You give me a seventh, a sixth, a fifth, and another seventh from the year after that. All right, so they're Dustin Brown for those two firsts again, but now they don't have to accept the one-way contract like goofs. Will it go through? So, oh, my God, come on, man. You're going to make me add a third or a fourth in there? Jesus. You're stumbling over that much? Just give it to me. God, so much micromanaging here. Uh, two first again. Now I want that uh, that guy back again. What was his name? I forget. Uh, one way, Trop, there he is. Right wingers, Dustin Brown, there we go. Now give me these draft picks. Seven, six, f f oh, whoa, 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 six. I don't want to give up the third. Don't make me come back here and offer the third. All right, don't make me come back in here, friggin' uh, Detroit. Just, I uh, just accept this. Here we go. Come on, accept it. Oh my God, are you kidding me? All right, they're getting a little bit back for that first round pick now. I mean, uh, for Dustin Brown now, but whatever. I said Dustin Brown's gonna go. We really don't have any other prospects to pick up. We've we picked up everyone already. Um, and I don't want to get salary back. I want to save the salary for Ekman Larson. All right, that's the whole that's the whole point of this. Uh, Dustin Brown. There we go. All right. Give me this guy again. Where is he? One way, one way drop. There he is. All right. So I'm going to have to add third. That's fine. I'll just add it. All right. Add the third for you, the fourth for you, the fifth, and the sixth. All right. Dustin Brown, a third, a fourth, a fifth, and a sixth for the two first. Come on now. Holy crap. Are you kidding me? All right. I don't think they get him. I don't think they get him. I think I find another team. They don't want him. They don't want him. Fine. It's fine by me. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna beg for it. Screw that. Winnipeg. You can actually no no no. Winnipeg is in the East. Washington's in the East. Vancouver. You want him? Uh no. St. Louis. You want him? St. Louis wants him. All right. Let's check out Van, uh, St. Louis here. Two firsts. There you go for Dustin Brown. All right. I'll give you the same offer that I gave these guys. The third and the fourth. And the fifth and the sixth. All right, does St. Louis want Dustin Brown? They still don't. My God. This one's taking a while here. I might have to just give in. This is taking too long. Uh, go back to St. Louis again. Oh, there you go. Come on, boys. Just give it. Jesus. This is a fair deal. All skaters. They wanted that uh, one-way contract as well. One way, one way. There it is. Love away. All right, Dustin Brown. You know what? Is there any other young rookies that are, like, uh, over the age of 24 that I can just trade away? Uh, Hacken, no, he's 24. I'll keep him. Lemieux, Eliuk, I'll keep them both. Uh, a Golden, 26, I'm keeping him. Grumay, yeah, Grumay Morris I can trade. He wasn't that, he's not turning out to be that good. Yeah, that's it. All right, so you get Grumay Morris. You get my third. You get my fourth. All right, and I'll even add in another fourth from next year. All right, that's a lot better. 
That's a pretty good deal right there. Come on, St. Louis. Let it go through. There you go. Well, it's an absolute no-brainer. Thank you. It's about time it's an absolute no-brainer, all right? So there you go, boys. We've done it. It's taken a while. We did it, though. All right, we traded up for the first overall pick. We uh, got rid of guys like Shattenkirk and Beaulieu. I know you guys didn't see that one coming, all right? But um, it's time to completely... Change up the dynasty, all right? We've uh, we've had enough guys ready to come up in the system. Uh, I want to keep Ekman Larson so that we can use him to trade for another super stud of a defenseman. All right, we already have our forwards line um, lines uh, ready to go. All right, our young guns are ready to come up. We got to give uh, guys like Len Little and Nick Ritchie the money. All right, and uh, Bolu wasn't that expensive, but I didn't like his off. I didn't like his defensive category. All right, I want to go to an all defensive defensive team. All right, we're really going to get behind Malcolm Subban here. And we were able to uh, hold on to uh, Bernie Mac. So we'll quickly just take a look at this. Goaltenders, all right? So we have Bernie Mac and Subban signed for at least uh, Bernie for another three, Subban for another four. All right, so that's good. Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, all right. Uh, defenseman. All right, so look, Ekman Larson. Let's see what he much, how much he wants. We have $15 million to work with. He wants $12 million freaking dollars. All right, so I may be able to get that down to like ten and a half. All right, but he's gonna want ten and a half million dollars. So that's what I mean. Um, but I want to be able to get him so that we can trade him. That can be our one off season trade. All right. Um, yeah, yeah. Okay. So then Subban, we may be able to sign. But even without Ekman Larson and even without Bolu and Shattenkirk, look who we still have: Hedman, Fenske, Bison. Bowen, all right, there's four, and then all these young guys who are ready to come up uh, soon as well, Pody with the A-, minus, uh, Kalus who has the B, um, Webb, all these young guys who we got, so I mean we were fine for young prospects defensively, okay, uh, but I want to get Ekman Larson signed, we, so there's 10 million to Ekman Larson, uh, Nielsen, we maybe will assign him long term, he's going to be a young guy for us, Len Little, so... Ekman Larson and Len Little together, maybe we we'll, uh, we're able to sign them. Nick Ritchie, I don't think we can sign all three of those guys. Piero Zobatel definitely can't sign them with those guys. But the difference is that the guys that we need to sign, like Ekman Larson, the $10 million man or whatever you want to call him, we can sign him and then all, everybody else we can just tender qualifying offers so that we can get to the free agency stage, trade Ekman Larson, and then sign all of these guys. So we got to a point that we can uh, we can keep everyone that we have now, definitely. No uh, no doubt, all right? So that's why we got rid of Bolu and Shattenkirk to free up that extra $7 million that we needed just to get Ekman Larson, all right? He's, uh, he's got a steep price on him, but we're going to sign him long term and then trade him right away. All right, and we're going to fill up that gap. Maybe Ekblan from Florida. All right, boys, so let me know. Let me know. Forwards, it's looking like this. Uh, our top nine is going to be Stamco, Sagan, Little, Lofthaus, uh, The Nuge, Granny Smith, uh, Shen, Harper, Richie. All right, there's our top nine. But then we also have guys like Henry, uh, Golden, Rahak, Piero Zobatel, Lemieux, Nielsen, who may want the chance. All right, plenty of young guys. So there's a look at our forwards and defensemen once again. The way I'm looking at it is get Hedman. Uh, trade Ekman Larson for that Ekbland guy. So you got Hedman, Ekbland, Fenske, Bison, ba uh, Bowen, all right, who uh, proved himself and he's going to be playing. And then maybe sign Jordan Subban or maybe give uh, one of these guys the shot as well. Or maybe try to, uh, since we're getting Ekman Larson, a huge trade value back, maybe try to get two defensemen from Florida if we can afford it, all right? So that's my thought process, boys. Let me know, who should we go after defensively? I think that Ekblan guy is good. Remember, this is eight years in, so uh, I already did the pre-scouting. Uh, it was that guy from Colorado or Ekblan. Let me know who uh, who is better and who would fit our team, all right? But we're going into year nine. We've uh, completely changed the way our team looks, but I'm expecting to still be competitive, all right, boys? Maybe three Stanley Cups in a row. I don't know. It's a big hill to climb, but uh, even without players like Brown, Ekman, Larson, Shattenkirk, and Bull, you will be able to get it done, all right? Thank all those guys for their time here in Tampa Bay, but it's time to move on.